Ginnigay, my name's Brenton Lugnan and I'm a Gumbanga artist from Yurunga on the mid-north coast of Australia. And I've been brought on board through the National Aboriginal Design Agency to work with Onterra to come up with a design that will be utilised to come out with a carpet range for the international market. It's uh, really exciting for me and I've gone with a piece that describes my family and my connection to my country. When I started to think about what I was going to do for this piece, I realised that it should just be a part of the works that I'm doing at the moment, which are all uh, revolving around my being back here on country, around the Yurunga and the Bellingen Valley, which is where my family's from traditionally. So it's, so it's part of my reflections on my time being back on my country. And, uh, and these are uh, almost a reclamation of Gumbanga art because we lost so much during the massacres and things that an entire style needed to sort of be redeveloped. So what I've endeavoured to do over the last few years and, and a bunch of other um, Guri artists around the coast and that sort of thing is we're sort of coming up with a, a, a new Gumbanga style and way of representing our country which gives it a sense of identity and uniqueness that it, that it has. So in my pieces, because we were saltwater, freshwater people, um, I try to represent one or the other aspect in some way. So in this one, we have the river going through the middle of the piece. And then we have along the edges of the river are all of the uh, representations for people. In this case, they're the ancestors and all the people that came before us who were sustained and nourished by the river and, and everything it had to offer. And then in the middle, we've got my family uh, symbol. And it, it just sort of shows that all of our spirit comes from our, our, our connection to country. And then we take it with us out into our families. These are other family units. So yeah, as, as the family grows and spreads out, we still take a piece of home with us. So it's really about that connection to country. And um, the circles in the landscape, well, we did use circles and, and dotage and that sort of thing around here, but it was mainly for um, body ornamentation and um, for corroboree and that sort of thing and initiation. So it had, the, they really have a very high spiritual significance and um, so when I use them, rather than use them to, des to describe a landscape, so to speak, I'm using them to actually describe how sacred the land is to us and has been for so long. And that connection again. So yeah, it's just layer upon layer of connection to the country.